All right, is this recording? Yeah. It's, it's been recording for one, one and a half minutes. Okay. Oh, yeah. All right. All right. Hey, um, hey, YouTube. We're trying something new. This isn't YouTube. Welcome. This is going straight on Twitter. <laughs> I mean, Twitter? Now, hey, we're, Twitter? Well, I mean, we're probably going to put it on YouTube, too. Hey, YouTube. I thought we were putting it on YouTube. <laughs> Just, hello, everyone. This Hi, is nice. this is Dad5. And uh, from our left, we have Nick Masig. That's my left. Yeah, I was gonna say, you can't decide who all of our lefts are. My left, Nick Fisig. Hey, hi. It doesn't really hi. matter what position yes, we're in. From, and from his left, from we're, we're, <laughs> just all, we're just all here. It's... From his left, Tom. Hi. And, and from Tom, his what, left, is, what is on your left? Midge. <laughs> Hello. And what's on your left, Midge? It's Bud. Bud, it's, what's it's, on your left? It's Bud. It, James. James, what's James on your left? My left? I am James, and on my left, but, Nick. No. Yes, and on my left is Tom. So, please. If, if you Who's can, on your left, Tom? Tom. And on my left is Dreams. If you can imagine, <laughs> we're all here. Okay. Now, well, Alright, the idea we, here is we're going to record a bunch of our thoughts, and um, we, we've all we've all taken down some journals, what have you, and we're, we're planning on reading a bit of them. But as fate would have it, we all don't <laughs> have ours with us, except Bud. Wait, Bud. What? Bud has his <laughs> We uh, so, really? We actually didn't do journals. Why? Because we want Bud's journal. <laughs> we want Bud's oh, journal. It's all been a sham. I, so we had this plan. So we, Bud. we have <laughs> Bud's journal. It was, it was really elaborate. <laughs> it, it, it was really <laughs> fucked up because we didn't tell Bud. We told him we were taking all journals. <laughs> yep. And Bud took a journal and burned stuff down. I'll be one. fair. I do have a journal at home. I I totally I didn't bring it. I totally will keep one. I don't have one. <laughs> All right. See, the reason why I have one because I don't have many thoughts. I just go by day to day. <laughs> you know, kind of just living life. And this is why know, we answer him to keep a journal. <laughs> yeah, we we instructed him to keep the thought of all. We instructed him to keep a journal of all of his thoughts. And here he's done that, and now we can present it to you. All of our, all of our <laughs> faithful God bless know, you listeners. No. Yeah. <clears throat> so. Um, he wrote down a list of shit have, in the uh, first couple of pages. We're we, gonna read them too. We have day one highlights <laughs> of one April, April 4th. To are, the, are we gonna take turns reading it? We no, no. Who, I mean, who, well, we didn't ask him if you wanted to read it. We just assumed that you we were gonna read it, but if you want to read some too. I'm not reading it. I, I would, hate reading out loud. I would like to, but... But you can do some if he wants to read some, too. Yeah, if, I don't think Tom if, wants if to or want. cares. We can't have Bud read it because this is his own fucking journal. I, I, part of me kind of wants Bud to read it because everything sounds funnier out of Bud's voice. That's true. <laughs> but he might skip some good parts. That's true. We, we, can, we can do quality assurance. Well, yeah, here's the thing <laughs> also. Um, please tell me this is not all just... Me, right? It's 100% you. you. No, it's not me. This is all going to be yeah, you. Yeah. Your journal. Well, you just started the show. The reason, why we, the reason why we did this was because you have it's <laughs> a really <laughs> good mind. You have a really good mind. It's so, your, your outlook on things is brilliant. Oh, and, is it? And yes. It's completely different from everyone else's in a really good and weird, funny way. We wanted to make sure you kept the good. Uh, what the fuck? This is why we couldn't keep the TV on. Some, <laughs> some Asian guy is cutting tomatoes right now. I don't know, it's a knife you have in your house. Yeah, he's what? fucking it up. Alright, what's, um... <clears throat> right, uh, let's, let's just right, jump so into Bud's the, mind. But yeah, we wanted to know more about Bud's mind, so we had this plan to tell him to keep a journal. We've, we've gotten him to elaborate on more of his thoughts. We've explained to him what thinking is, and now we're going to get, it's as, as Tom says, a bit more of an insight into Bud's mind. And the only so, way to kind of trick him into doing it is to make him believe that we're all doing it, because... <laughs> If he knew we were all doing it, he would do it one, too. It's not that excited. But if we just told him it was just going to be him, he would keep some of the things out. Yeah. And we want a good amount of... We we, 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 exen- we essentially exposed him. We, we exploited his innocence. The only one that knows what's in this journal right now is Bud. Yeah, until so we read it. We're all going to be going on this journey with you. My thoughts aren't that exciting. There we go. <laughs> oh, oh, I, I beg to differ. You're going to be proved... Solidly wrong. Unless we're wrong, <laughs> and we're gonna read it like Bud got bread. <laughs> Bud got milk. It's no. like cool. Bud. It says it in the third person. Yeah. <laughs> May fifth, fourteen thirty-seven. Uh, I guess here, here we have. Start the, whenever you want. Mm-hmm. If you have any questions, I'm here. <laughs> Highlights of April fourth, two thousand fifteen. Went to the casino for the first time. Red Death cocktail. Ten out of ten. Yeah. <laughs> you put ten out of ten. <laughs> Bud, huh? I know for a fact you're lying here. What do you mean? 
You did not get to the con you did not get to the casino for the first time on April 4th, 2015. That was my first time. You went with me and Tom. Yeah, that was that was you guys. That was that, that time. time. Yeah. yeah. That was it, yeah. That was April. Red Death Cocktail? Yeah. Remember I ordered cocktail? You got the free drink and she came over and she was like, make sure you're playing a game next time I come over. Yeah, and I don't think I don't, I don't think I <laughs> That was in her April? Either. Yeah. Yeah. You didn't tip her? <laughs> <laughs> Dude, you didn't tip her in April? What's wrong with you? Oh my god. But uh any yeah. other time of the year that flies. Mm -hmm. Is that right? Ten out of ten? You did. You were uh, a cool. I mean, cocktail. Ten out of ten. It was good. <laughs> what was in it? Uh no, you, you, mm. you look it up. I don't. I don't know. Uh, oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Clearly, quality <laughs> ingredients yes. according to Bud. You remembered it so well. <laughs> Here we have next day, April fifth, two thousand fifteen. No. Operation try and fix and clean the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> Operation fix and clean the bathroom. Is it your bathroom? It's, it's, tell us about that. It's, it's a family bathroom. Um, it's Why is it your job? Because no one else is gonna do it. Yeah. <laughs> so I, got the operation so, so I took it upon myself to... I didn't do anything. So we can cross this one out. <laughs> Wait, there's a checklist though. Wait, what did he. What? What, <laughs> <laughs> what, is, what is the checklist? Mm. Alright, what's wrong with the bathroom first? Uh, a lot of stuff. I mean, it's just dirty. Um, <laughs> is it the one I use upstairs? That's the only one we what, have. What, yet. Well, you said it's a family bathroom. Yeah. It's the only bathroom you have. <laughs> Obviously, it's a fucking family bathroom. Wait, 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 wait. You said clean and fix. So far, you've only listed it's dirty. What did you have to fix? Like, the shower. <laughs> what shower. do you mean? Well, well there's, there is the a shower. checklist. Alright, let's get a checklist. Clean. Get new toilet paper holder. Yes, we, we don't have a toilet paper holder. Hold your toilet paper what happened to that? <laughs> with your hand, like a all person. Right, right. Here is how our toilet paper holder is set up now. Most people have the thing on the wall where you just, you know, you roll it and you take it. There you go. We have this, yeah. like, little towel rack thing that we see ha hang on the wall that's now on the floor that we put it on there. <laughs> what? And, uh, wait, what's the point? If it's on the floor, what's the point? Why do you have well, something well, on the floor to put the toilet paper on? You can still roll it, is what because, he says. Yeah, because I guess yeah, you can pull yeah. it still, but... I, wait, the towel rack thing, like one of those long-ass ones? Yeah, you jack yeah. it through the toilet so paper you roll, you just right? have a little toilet paper roll on, on the this long-ass fucking rack on the ground. No, 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 no. Well, no, no. He, he actually has that in the next list, a uh, hang-up towel rack. <laughs> I guess you uh, you picked one over the other, huh? But yeah. yeah. <laughs> so you do shit with this bathroom? Did you hang it up? No. Oh my god. No, dude. It's being used for the toilet paper. No, hold on. Let's let's look at the other ones. Uh, clean tiled floors and walls. Mm, Le wall. Learn to caulk shower. Remove and apply caulk for shower. <laughs> that, that kind of applies to the fourth one, though. You didn't that one. So, what what of these I think have you I, done so far since uh, since April fifth? Nothing. <laughs> Why? This was like a dream plan of his. He wrote it all down. He's like, "This is gonna happen." Wait, you could have at least bought the toilet yeah, paper. Like, right, you didn't even you didn't even change some this toilet is, paper. Hold it. We're reading it November seventh right now. I think it's the eighth now. <laughs> yeah. And this is from April. He had this big elaborate plan, a checklist, everything. Nothing checked off. Hmm. I'll get some stuff done by the <laughs> next pocket yeah, to let everyone wait. know, hey guys, <laughs> the toilet paper is now hung up. <laughs> we have a toilet paper holder now. <laughs> don't no, read ahead, read man. Ahead. I don't want you to read ahead, man. I'm sorry. You have to read it all, man. What? I'm sorry. All right. We're on April 8th, 2015 now. What, did we skip a few days? No. I mean, we did, but this is the next part in the journal yeah. from the oh, last okay. I read. Yeah. He skips the weekends. Um, <laughs> <laughs> too busy <laughs> Yo. Take a fab five dads family picture. <laughs> <laughs> we, have, we haven't done that. We did oh, plan that though. That was a real plan. How we planned that? Uh, well, uh, we I think we should still do it and then yeah. use that image as this podcast video. Yeah, we, uh, uh, let's let's we get that. We just time. use a big close up of Bud's face. We're, that's, we're, that doesn't show all of us. Yeah, I mean, yeah but it's, it's all about you, baby. Work, work more. Day. Work more on the gaming channel in general. Okay. I mean, I mean I've, I've been it, thinking about that and I was like, we could do, we could do a lot more than game. We can do whatever, whatever the hell we want, really. 
a um, music video reviews. Eat at the Half Moon yeah. restaurant. I completely agree with that. We still uh, yeah. haven't done that. We've been planning that for about a year now. We haven't done We're that. We're gonna get bison and we're gonna buy some steaks. Yak, all and that then stuff. Make the mockumentary, bitch, I'm having so much fun. Oh my god! I forgot about yes. that. He has he has little musical notes written next to that. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? What, sorry, elaborate on this because half our fans don't know what the fuck's going on, um, and I don't know what the fuck well, this is. A while ago, but we were all just hanging out, and we thought. We're going to have a, a mockumentary about a pop sensation that had... He broke out with a song called Bitch, I'm Having So Much Fun. Yeah. And when Bitch, I'm Having So Much Fun, do not, do not, bitch, I'm having so much fun. That's a real song? That, no, it's no. not. It's something we made up. Oh. But that was going to be the entirety of the song, and we're going to make a mockumentary on what that person's doing now. Yeah, yeah. His name like, was after his um, fame. But this could be another thing. His name was DJ song. Duda. And then, of course, <laughs> uh, and, uh, of course, we have mini golf, laser tag, go-karts. We yeah. haven't done any of that. We did, we did play <laughs> well, mini golf. We, we, did, we, did, we did do yeah. one of the three. We played mini golf. Yes, we did. I wasn't there for that one. You weren't. Yeah. But we did do that. Yeah, he wasn't there for that. I probably probably why I don't remember it. Um, oh, thanks. Oh, that makes me feel good oh. about myself. <laughs> makes me feel good about Tom and Bud, too. <laughs> I'm so glad. About oh, wait, this continues. Yeah, this no, no, we, no, wait, we have plenty. Oh, wait, that's months later. Yeah, we have, uh, wow. Yeah, but that's Holy three months shit. later. We yeah. have July 8th, 2015 <laughs> now. We've jumped ahead. Wait, wait, so wait, the other ones were from 2014? Well, no, no they, they, were from two, yeah, they were all from April, but they were from 2015, so... And then we jump ahead three months. Okay, so now we're in June? But what happened? No, we're in July. Okay, for we're some reason I thought you said January. We're in, so we're in July like, 8th. We're, back. <laughs> we're in July 8th. Okay. Song, song checklist for New York. Oh, this is just what I wrote down for New York when we were going, you know, making a playlist. Bud went on a trip to New York to visit a friend of his. Yeah. yeah and visit Terry. Here's his songs. Um, oh, yes. Just in case you wanted to know. Yes, here are all the, uh, we have, the songs. We have Never There by Cake. Mm-hmm. Underwater Rhymes by Digital Underground, mm-hmm. the new style Beastie Boys, uh, the Humpty Dance, but then you have you have an arrow <laughs> pointing up to the Digital Underground by the Humpty Dance. Is that just also by the Humpty Dance? No, the the Humpty Dance is done by Digital Underground. Yeah, right. That's why. Uh... All right. Um, <laughs> Magic Swan by. Wadini Houdini Houdini <laughs> it's, it's, it's Houdini with a W because right. Houdini yeah. <laughs> Hu- Houdini uh, Major, <laughs> ma- Major Laser Pond de Floor Nice uh, <laughs> DJ Snake You Know You Like It Don't it's Stop the Party like Black Eyed Peas That has an asterisk next to it What's that? Wait, wh- wait, what? Black Eyed Peas has an asterisk next to it Um... Maybe I really wanted that on there. <laughs> I don't remember why this I did that. Song. This is a song like to play. That, like, I mean, he fills this. the rest of the CD with that song, <laughs> and then he just shuffles. And then, of course, we have uh, Pitbull, Fireball. Yeah. Which, um, I don't want Fireball ever again, really. I, uh, what happened with that song? I never <laughs> wanted Well, one is my Pitbull. Yeah. But why don't you like it so much that you never want it again? It's not that good. <laughs> After listening to it like a good year from now, he's just like, you know what? I don't like this song. It shouldn't be on this playlist anymore. Um, now, I, now I want. Oh wait, here we go. Here's I want Gold Schlager by Pitbull. Here, here's where we actually have the week of thoughts. After we started telling them to write down his thoughts. Yes. Um. That was, that was all pre yeah, this. Is, this is oh, something he actually the, made before we told him to make a journal. That was just the precursor. Yeah. Yeah. October, <laughs> October 14th. Wait. What uh, the fuck? What? October 14th to the 21st. I'm sorry. Uh, which cat becomes dominant if brought home at the same time? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, come on! <laughs> That's actually a good question. I don't know the answer to that one. That's a legitimate question. <laughs> but, wait, wait, what? What do you mean? Yeah, where did this come from? You only have two cats, right? Yeah. You brought Luna home way before the other one. Uh, no, uh, this isn't about his life. No, this isn't about... It's just, it's just yeah. Right. Um, <laughs> which one does become the like, It just depends on personality at that yeah. point, I guess. Well, that's a, like, the, when you think about it, with the, like, the dogs we have, Ben and Omar, yeah. we got them kind of at the same time. Yeah. So fighting. it's like, which one is dominant between the two? I want to say Omar. I would say Omar. They probably had Omar. him for a good week before, but still. Omar like, will straight up push Ben off the couch to get your attention. <laughs> that's true. But he, yeah, so he, he has abandonment. I guess, yeah, I guess so it yeah, depends on I don't, I don't know if it's so much dominance as it is attention whoring. Yeah. Yeah, it's the personality, I guess. Um, <laughs> I have the next one. 
Ah uh, wait, what the fuck? Hmm? What? <laughs> what the fuck? What? Wait, how can smells for X weed wake you up? <laughs> <laughs> wait, um, what are you, t- what? What are you uh, talking uh, about? Let me let me see this. Um, <laughs> got it. Oh, uh, I actually brought this up to you before. What does that mean? Um, how? It's weird, but like, how can smells, like, if you're sleeping, be that strong enough to wake you up? The X is example weed from my neighbors that woke me up. Oh. It woke you up before. Yes. I don't know. Like it, I was sleeping, and be, I was like, it might just be a I... smell you're not used to, so your brain, your brain's kind of waking up on that new stimulation. Hmm. Yeah. Unless it's similar to how hearing things, something like yeah. you know, it's just a sensory stimulation. Unless mm-hmm. like you heard something that woke you up, but you didn't think it was as hearing because right away when you woke up, you might have smelled the weed. Yeah. So you might have just assumed like, it was the weed that's... smell that woke you up. I don't know. Yeah, that, hmm. that's true. You could have just woken up for some other reason. And some kind of sound that didn't that happen again when I woke up. Yeah. Yeah. But this next one, um, I know what you wrote, but. I was having a I was wait. Did someone time. say on like Facebook that like when you're sleeping you can't smell anything? I won't post that like yesterday or something. I don't. I don't believe that for a second. Smells definitely can wake me up. Dog shit wakes me up all the time. <laughs> they smell of breakfast. Yeah, breakfast. Exactly. Breakfast. My mom. My mom started making steaks the other morning. It woke me right up. Mmm, bacon. If your mom ever makes dog shit, it's really gonna wake you up then. Yeah. Hey, bacon, bread, no, sausage. No, I know, but. <laughs> Uh, what cancer did they inject in sharks? Yes. Wait, what? <laughs> I, I, I want to know. What do you mean, what cancer? Well, they found out sharks are immune to uh, cancer. I, I, know, I, know, I know this, but like, what What are you talking about? What cancer? Like, did, what kind of did cancer? Did they give the shark what? breast cancer? Not, <laughs> no, there's not, there's not, like, there's not different kinds of cancer. It's just different dependent on where it is. It's not like the cancer itself is different. Yeah. <laughs> they just gave it can- Well, they yeah. tried to give it cancer. Oh yeah. yeah, is there just one type of cancer? It's just depending on where it's at. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's, it's, it's just a mutation. It's not like breast cancer <laughs> is different from lung cancer. They can't breast cancer. cancer you but... can't even really inject cancer into someone. It's not. Um, it's not like a virus or anything. It's it's just a mutation in yourself. Yeah. <laughs> shit, right. blood shit. All right. Well, just a shout out to Loot Crate because this is the journal that Bud puts his. Uh, oh yeah. <laughs> oh wait, yeah. We're, we're sponsored yeah, we're by Loot using, Crate. Yeah. The field, the field notes here from the, uh, what was it, Secret Month, was yeah, it? Yeah, uh, Espionage. Es- espionage, Secret Month, but, I forget what it was. But it's described to Loot Crate. But that's the, that's the Described. Journal. He's described, described to Loot Crate. <laughs> it was just like I said describe, but I mean subscribe. That's the Self-scribe. journal that this is all written in. Mm-hmm. Um, there we go. Uh, can normal shampoo kill fleas? <laughs> uh, that's a good that's actually a pretty good question. I don't know. I, like, like maybe it's just less efficient at it. I, I know that yeah. fleas like cleaner hair. I mean, I, I don't that's, know. That's hard to tell. Shampoo that, might they, kill. they only they but, only really jump onto dogs. So all the chemicals. But no, the they, thinking, Well, I guess I'm thinking of lice for some reason. Oh, wait, no, I'm thinking of lice too. Yeah, like, but they, like they have hair. like they have like special like shampoo for the lice. Uh, yeah, yeah, lice. Would you would you what do you mean a normal shampoo? Like, uh, the one I have. Tresemme. Tresemme. With the kid shampoo that's shaped like a fish that has, like, the shape, like, yeah, the fish. Uh, tear free, but they're my favorite. Yeah. Oh, the no, kid. No. I was like, you, yes. you would never really use this on a dog, though, would you? You wouldn't use. Well, I guess. Well, are you talking about fleas on dogs or fleas on. That's us? really the only no, thing they go on, though. No, because I, I know they have, like, the flea shampoo already for dogs and animals. I would just mean like if you had fleas on you and you use like, like humans, y- human that fleas human in your hair, yeah. and they're just like, oh, I'll just use regular human shampoo. Yeah, shampoo. Well, <laughs> well, if humans get fleas, there's a lot less because less of their body is covered by thick hair. Yeah, mm, that's I think, true. <clears throat> I think the point of flea shampoo is my theory is that it's it's strong enough to kill the fleas, but not really strong enough to damage the dog's skin. Hmm. Good question, folks. <laughs> both of my cats have fleas right now, and it's really annoying. Maybe you should give your sister a bath. <laughs> you call your sister a cat? I don't know. Somebody, <laughs> I don't know. Somebody needs to get a bath. <laughs> and I'm blam- Boy, I have to fix the fucking shower I'm, first. I'm, I'm, blaming, I'm blaming either your sister or Scott. Well, then get a bath if they had a towel rack with their towels shit. on. But this is all yeah. your fault. Yeah, this is why you guys have fleas right now, because your bathroom's all fucked up because you never clean. You fixed it. Seven months, bud. You've had seven months. Oh, 
Oh, it's an April. <laughs> All right. This is not a, a journal reading session. This is an intervention. <laughs> yes. Right. For you to clean your fucking bathroom. We're worried about you. Oh, yeah. no. Yeah. Now, then we have a next one. Is borderline asthma a thing? <laughs> yes. Yes. Y- yes, it is. Okay, cool. See, I don't... Is it, though? I don't know. You can <laughs> have very non-severe asthma. That's kind of like borderline asthma. Yeah, it kind of depends on your definition of borderline. Um, yeah. The reason why I brought this up is because there have been many times that I've been to the doctor, and that's kind of what I have. Is well, it, though? Yeah. Don't you already have your answer, then? But it's... It doesn't seem like a thing. Now, do you, do you have borderline asthma, or do you just have weak lungs? What? <laughs> I thought that was kind of like the same thing. I don't know. I thought that, no, I thought asthma that was... is a condition where your lungs kind of lock up a little bit when, they, when you breathe heavily. From my understanding. Not I remember, I remember don't in middle that. school, I actually had to take, uh, like, the in- inhaling, like, steroids or whatever for that. 2015. Uh, that's why you're jacked as fuck. Yeah, oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> like, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not trying to mock you here, but, I mean, you're, you're a bit of a, a bigger fella. Yeah. And the, those of your stature typically don't have the best lung. Yeah. So I'm thinking, so yeah, maybe, doctors, do you, to account. do you have borderline asthma or do you just have weak lungs? So maybe when I was in middle school and I took that... Didn't so that, this is a question stemming from years ago, then. Yeah, I mean, I don't know if I still have... It's stuck in your head that long. Maybe they, they were just like, you're fat, but they didn't want to tell me. <laughs> <laughs> so the, the way this people around it is like, yeah, uh, you might have asthma. Uh, here you oh. go, take this. Yeah. It, it was just air. Yeah. <laughs> has, it, has this been playing in your mind the whole time? Do you actually I have an inhaler? It. Yeah. Do you use it? No. <laughs> Why not? Because it's just, cause it's just it? air. <laughs> well, that's, you figured it out early. That's, that's the point, though. No, as we did, no. Yeah, there's actual medicine. Yeah. yeah. I don't know. Well, like, maybe, maybe, I don't know, maybe that would help. Yeah, you, know, you get exhausted very easily. Maybe you do have minor asthma. Maybe I just need to go to the gym more and work in cardio. No, I think maybe oh. like minor asthma. <laughs> you this job at FedEx, you might lose some pounds. Yeah. All right, well, hang on. Why, why are you so reluctant to take the doctor's advice as a professional? <laughs> uh, because I can she's a bit of a bitch. Oh. What? Well, I was just gonna say quack. Whore. Oh, all right. <gasps> you don't think you don't think she's a qualified doctor? All right. Well, uh, nice guy. Real quick, <laughs> asthma with an inhaler. Don't worry, I'll edit that. <laughs> you like Elsa? <laughs> they give you 14 shots from it, or maybe more, depending on how much you had to pay. Yeah. Damn, all right. Okay. So, so my little lot? brother has an inhaler. Like 14 shots. Oh. No. <laughs> yeah. All right. So. Or get you dead. <laughs> you don't need to take it every day. You just need to take it when you're actually out of breath. You cannot breathe. If you ever. If you never really hit that limit, you're pretty much good. But if you're like at the point that you're just like, Ugh! and you can barely breathe, once you hit the asthma twice, it like sets you back. Like it, not asthma, the inhaler twice. Sometimes you hit it twice. Sometimes you just need. My little brother has to hit it twice. Yeah, like, one time. He, 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 he might have severe asthma. He Actually, does, um, but I don't know if this happens to like you guys, like when you drink. But like, there are a lot of times also where if I get like really like drunk, it's hard for me to breathe. Like, like, I'll be sitting there like, like, I, I can't really, like, fully breathe. I, I don't know why. It might just be that you have a lot of liquor in your stomach. Because there has been times I'm just yeah. like, and then, like, I burp something off. Man, many, many times when I do drink, I do need to take in a bit more air to keep myself from vomiting. Yeah, so, so I mean, I mean you, you might honestly have minor asthma. Your doctor might be onto something, <laughs> I think. But maybe, as long as maybe, you don't really Maybe need... you should leave the diagnosis up to the professionals. <laughs> well, do, you, do you still have the, uh, the inhaler? Yes. All right, well, Somewhere in my room. You don't really need to take it. It's just like if you really cannot breathe or something. Yeah. Then take it. Where is because, the Although, I'll, I'll, if also... If you're fine without it, then you're pretty much good. My brother looks like he's about to fucking die when he needs to. He's like, <gasps> can't breathe. Mm-hmm. Like, he really can't breathe, and that clears up his throat. It's like the best. The inhaler? I have no idea. You have no idea. It's somewhere in my room. Right. <laughs> but uh, also... Brilliant. Does... That doesn't go bad, does it? I don't know. Uh, I, I think I, so. I'm not, I'm not qualified enough to tell you. <laughs> How long have you had it? Since, like, middle school. Alright, then you did not have to use it? I haven't used it in many years. But you used it before? Yeah. Okay. So you really know how it feels, though, when you use it. Mm-hmm. If you didn't really have to use it, you might be good. Did mm-hmm. you see a doctor after using it? Yeah. Did they mm-hmm. tell you you need to, still, like, still use it? Well... Because it could just have at that time. 
I can't you remember. Did start, it's been a while. Because you did start to lose some weight after that two during high school. So mm. it could yeah. just be the weight problem. Maybe. Maybe. Well, it doesn't have a problem. He's beautiful. He is beautiful, but it's just like... You're, you're <laughs> the beautiful, fact that you're, but your lungs are shit. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, his lungs might not be shit. Like, when you think about it, like, the stomach, I guess, like, just having that, like... A bigger stomach, I guess, could fill up that area of the lung, so it's really hard to breathe mm. because there's so much stuff yeah. down there. So the bigger you are, the harder your lungs have to work. Yeah. More, more blood vessels, need more oxygen. Yeah, so... Alright. For your health. I mean, if you want, yes. this could even be an exercise for you. Look for your fucking inhaler. Yeah, <laughs> write, write that down and we'll read it at the end. Yeah. <laughs> what is a lobotomy? <laughs> a, lo- a, lo- a lobotomy? Yeah. So, so they remove the frontal lobe of your brain. Yeah. All right. Thank you. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. I know, but has another question. What's the point of that? Um, it fixes certain behavioral issues. It also will pretty much make you retarded. But... Disables. It disables fear in your brain. All right. I have a question now. Why do people do that? It, it, it used to it be was, a cure for yeah. um, like uh, schizophrenia and stuff. Oh. It, it was it was an older practice. They don't really do it as much anymore. Yeah, because, because I actually didn't know this answer. Yeah, I just hear it a lot. Bad. It's very bad to do that. We'll almost like, always end up a vegetable afterwards, but okay. Yeah, always there, hear there, people there, have been, there, have been, there have been cases of people that kind of made it out fine, and now they're just kind of almost emotionless. Like they're not yeah. scared of anything. They're not really. Worried they kind of become anything. assholes, really. Yeah. So Tom got one. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, Tom, where's your phone? Hello, bitch. No, I just have a headache. <laughs> All the time. <laughs> yeah, I, I do. I have a, such a fucking headache. They, they, well, we were drinking. Oh, right? anyway, we probably so. won't have that anymore. Yeah, we we gotta... Maybe we should get a lobotomy. Yeah. yeah. Fun fact about lobotomy: it's, it's usually done through the eye or the nose. I've honestly, yeah. I've honestly thought like, like an I, ice pick up there too. I've honestly <laughs> thought life might be That's easier uh, if I got one. I mean, well, if you became a vegetable, it definitely would, because you would literally have to do nothing but sit there. Okay, if, I, <laughs> if, I were, if I were one of the cases where it didn't, it was just like, it's kind of worked out for me. I didn't, I wasn't scared of anything, I didn't have any worries. Yeah, yeah I mean, But you wouldn't really be able to appreciate it. Yeah, yeah. I know that, I mean, oh. for many reasons, there's, there's reasons why I haven't looked into getting one. I think <laughs> it might be illegal at this point. Yeah. But there, there are, you can also kind of just, I guess, force yourself to stop caring about things like that. I know it's really hard. Yeah. But after a while, you can kind of die, de- like die inside. So. I mean, that's <laughs> yeah, that's not very good. That's kind of yeah, that's, that's, that's how the world it's works. Not, it's not I'm, cure, I'm, I'm, like, I'm well on my way. Yeah, it's just like uh, I'm pretty dead inside sometimes. So yeah. I can, I can, I can live life half the shit. <laughs> and I'm like, all right, cool. I have my gold slaughter. <laughs> what are thought clothes? What, right, do you, what, what do you think thought clothes are? Oh, thought? Yeah. I thought thought. you said thought. No. I'm like, thought? What the fuck you if, think if, about? If you well, had to I guess. Mean, if, you had, uh, yeah. if you had an a- the British accent. No, no, if, yeah. if you well, had to guess, well, what would tell you us, think thought clothes Tell us clothes what it is, because I could, I could tell you what they are, but go ahead. Revealing clothes? Pretty, pretty okay. much. Yeah. <laughs> For those of you that don't live in North America or perhaps aren't familiar with the vernacular, a thought stands for... That hoe over there. Why someone can be classified as a thought is beyond me, yeah. but Jerry Tomato would do it. Yeah, care. it's just like a sentence could be like, oh, that fucking thought. She's such a thought. But when you actually say it with the full words, it's just like, oh my god, that hoe over there, over there, <laughs> or some dumb shit. It doesn't make uh, sense. Black people thought of this. <laughs> wow. Congratulations, black people. Shout out to black people. <laughs> yeah, just yeah, putting out there, like, who thought of thought? Black people, not even gonna lie. Rappers and shit, they always say thought. Was so, it black people? Yeah, though? who the fuck would say that? Yeah, it was, it was primarily... <laughs> Like, nice guy. This stuff. got oh, very, very racist. Well, no, very, I mean, very I think, I think, I think it's just the same thought. Like, I, think where, he, where, I think he's right, but I think curve, we're, we're also we're also missing the issue of like they think of so many things that shape our now English language. Yeah. yeah. Like, like congratulations, I guess. But I know, thought like, is kind of a stupid thing. It's completely oh, stupid. Like, it's retarded. The word thought, I like the meaning of it. Like saying thought. That hoe over there. Really if it wasn't an sense. acronym, yeah, yeah, if it wasn't an acronym, I think, they were just like. I think we, means... we would need to find the original usage of it to see if it was really stupid or not, because the original usage of it may not have been that stupid. Yeah, but like the acronym of it is that hoe over there. So when someone says that acronym in a sentence, it's just like it doesn't make sense yeah. because they use some of the words. It's just become that. a word yeah. for being an acronym. So I like the word thought, like, uh, that bitch is a thought. But saying it's, that bitch is a thought, it's like that bitch is a, that hoe over there. 
What? If you tell someone that they're a thought to their face, does that make sense? It, no. You're a fucking yeah. thought. You're a fucking that hoe over there. Yeah. <laughs> it, doesn't, it doesn't make sense, but they would instantly translate it, and it would make sense to them. Because now it's a word as opposed uh, to an app. But yeah, like, uh. cl- uh, thought clothes is pretty much like booty shorts, I guess, or like things that show their ass or like show their yeah, cleavage. Nice, just to nice, show that they're a hoe. Nice or heel. Try, nice heel. Try over there. Get some, maybe, you know? <laughs> maybe it's up to the listener to grammatically fix it. Upon execution, we've already fixed yeah. it though. No, no, it's like if someone calls you a thought, it's up to you to change, you know, the, the words around so it fits grammatically. Right. Like mm. I'm, I'm that hoe over here. Yeah. But then that, I don't know. That just makes everyone sound a lot dumber when they use it. So don't use that word. Thought is a dumb word. Thank don't you, use black it. people. <laughs> yes. yes. Wow. wow. Two standing ovations. <laughs> We're not standing. We're sitting. Yeah, I'm standing. No, you're not. Can you not? Can you not? <laughs> Don't worry. <laughs> Why are you wearing a Lil Wayne shirt? Yay, Yay black people! <laughs> Go stupid! <laughs> you're influenced. Why do you want to have said without looking at it? Uh, <laughs> he looked at it all fucking night. Nice. I did. All right, we all know. Like, like, what do you mean you don't? Go I don't fucking look at people's shirts all night. Um, yes, you thanks, do. Tom. Yes, thanks. you do. Thanks. I, I don't look at. I, um, I didn't even know he was wearing a gray flannel to look yeah, at him now. Thank you for the abomin- abomination. <laughs> abomination. Abomination. Wow. Abomination. He doesn't look at people's shirts. What? Huh? Don't. Don't put them in your water. They're not. They're not <laughs> tasty. They. They won't melt. No. Wait. Who asked about the little wing shirt? Oh, I, I did. Probably. What? No, I didn't. Yes, you did. I, but. Okay, what? Well, <laughs> well, no, what? It, it, it was Nick. Bud Nick. just knew that what the shirts were. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I was about to say, no, Bud was the one who knew what it was. Uh, I got a, a pack of five shirts for $16 a hot topic. Okay. Not, not a sponsor. <laughs> We're not yeah. sponsored by shirts. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Alright, next, next thing. I don't like the sound of acoustic guitar. <laughs> right, right. Elaborate, elaborate on that. I know, I, I, know, I, I know you don't mean acoustic guitar in general. You just mean when they do the little slide thing and you hear the string, you hear the string scratch. I actually do hate. I absolutely hate really? that. Yeah, like I don't mind acoustic uh, guitar sounding, but when it's like, <laughs> like when you hear it, it's just like, it's like, come uh, on. Yeah, lift up your fingers, faggot. <laughs> <laughs> but then it won't make sound. <laughs> if you try hard enough, it will. It's, it's funny to me because I play guitar. That's like my yeah, thing. Yeah, yay! Like, it's, just, like, it's, it's funny because like Tom's in a band. there is no way you can play it yeah, without making that sound. <laughs> then don't do it. <laughs> okay, give up some. There's an acoustic in the trash. We don't have musicians. Anymore. Don't play. Don't play. Don't play guitar anymore. But doesn't like, like it. it. I'm never, I'll never play guitar again. Garbage. again. <laughs> Get you a guitar for Christmas, but no. an acoustic guitar. Acoustic, yeah, and you're gonna learn how to play. And I try to play without making that screeching yeah. noise. It's gonna be therapy. <laughs> all right. <laughs> I like that sound. Yeah, it's not like you're jacking off. <laughs> <laughs> all right, moving on. All right, all right. we have uh, the difference between whiskey, scotch, and bourbon. Bourbon, I think it's bourbon just scotch whiskey? made in Bourbon County. Or it's just whiskey made in bourbon county. I know that. I thought it, I thought it had to deal with how long they were actually aged. Hmm. Uh, I know that they're all they're all the same types of liquor. I know that. Yeah, they're all just whiskey. So being that neither of us are well, none of us are really educated enough. I don't like whiskey. That, it's delicious. I don't like alcohol. Oh, fuck off. If anyone knows, um, let us know. Having only one favorite thing is hard. What, what the fuck do you mean? <laughs> I mean Wait, I what? Right. Having only one favorite thing is I, hard. I, agree I guess that. you mean it's like, alright, name your favorite anime. Ah, oh, yeah, they're like five. I, mean, I agree. Yeah. What's your favorite color? I find it. Uh, well, I, the some color are easier color's than the only thing I think I can really find a problem with. Well, I definitely no, find it hard to have a favorite or anything. What's your favorite fast food restaurant? Taco Bell. I, I can't. Really? I would have said Taco Bell if I had really? to, yeah. But Burger. then I thought about it and KFC. My, yeah, oh. my, my favorite is Burger King, but I worked there for so long that I I need a break from Burger King for now. But see, I, I want to say Arby's, but then KFC. Yes, I can. We're here. Ah, uh, my favorite fast food place is FedEx. Yeah. Uh, I'll probably change after mm-hmm. I work there for you, though. <laughs> yeah, after you eat all those boxes, you know, it's a, little, <laughs> it's a lot different. You don't really want to get any more. With this. Yeah. There are some There's things that I like a favorite thing in general. Like if I, I don't ask you, I don't know. I know they're good. 
<laughs> that would be difficult. Yeah. But if I were to ask specifics, you could tell me, right? In, like, some specifics, yes, but some, there's a lot that I can't. Like, color is easy to make. Right. Blue and red. Uh, uh, no, that's, that's that, Those are two colors. So purple. Uh, I do like purple. There you go. <laughs> yeah. what, what's Done. your favorite, though? Yeah. Probably purple. Just one. All right. Uh, my, okay. my, my, my guy in Mass Effect is wearing purple. <laughs> What's your guy in Mass Effect wearing, Smidge? Brown. That's your favorite color. It's Next not. question. It's not. <laughs> Next question. Um, uh, favorite fast food restaurant? I don't know. It's either KFC or Arby's. <laughs> favorite porn star? I don't have a lot. I don't have one. <laughs> yeah, I don't have one favorite for a lot of things either. Favorite friend yeah. named Nick? I have a favorite for just about everything. I, I can, but I have like it, three it, favorites. Yeah, it turns me. into like a top five. <laughs> yeah. Like, what's your favorite anime? Great teacher and Izuka. I do have a favorite anime, actually, FLCL. That's the only thing I have an absolute favorite for. I, like, I'm in like the middle because, like, One Piece. One Piece is so uh, amazing, but then I start thinking about Hunter x Hunter and then New Yu Haga Show. And it's like, alright, Yu Yu Haga Show is my favorite series that has ended. But, yeah, Hunter you have to Hunter, break it down into categories. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's really bad. Like, I can't have just one favorite because there's, like, I've watched so many really good ones. And yeah. Hunter Hunter, I like obsess over, but One Piece, I also obsess over too. I definitely, I do break it down into categories. But if I if I had to pick one anime that I could, if I could only watch this anime ever again, it would be Great Teacher. See, that's the hardest thing for me because One Piece, One Piece is god like mm -hmm. to me at least. But Hunter Hunter, I can watch over and over and over again. That's just like to give up One Piece. I don't know. I want to see the ending and everything about it. I love, but to give up Hunter Hunter is definitely a really hard thing for me. Favorite song. I actually have a favorite for this too. Mm. What is it? Mm. Wedding song by the AAAs. Every time a fear and Lower than the Las Vegas album comes out, I always <laughs> have a favorite song for them. Four Obstacles by Sid Matters. Yeah. Meaning of Existence from Fear and Lower than Las Vegas is my favorite song right now. But it definitely changes. Yeah, I, mine changes. Right at the moment, life. that's my favorite. Um, move, bitch, get out the way. That's a good one. By who? Classic folk song. Uh, you know that girl. That black guy. My favorite song. Black eyes. My little brother's a black guy. Wasn't it? Also a turtle. He's a hey turtle. What? Yeah, he's not a black. It was. It was Luda Chris. It was Luda. Oh, was it Luda? Yeah, Luda. Uh, who's that fucking? Ooh, who's bitch. That, who's that get one? Out the way. Who's that one white guy who does it? Mac Miller. Uh, I don't know. Vanilla Ice. Joe, Joe Bowden. I might be thinking of. Who the fuck is what? Joe Bowden? <laughs> wait, what? Right? Steve Bowden's older no, brother. No, he's, he's, no, he's <laughs> actually Joe a rapper. Anyway, next, oh, next one. Next uh, one. All right, let's go. <clears throat> you like an underground rapper in our community that I don't. Do know all about. animals beg Bowden? for food when they need it? Yeah. Like, uh, wait, wait, well, wait, wait. No, wait. The, most of them hunt. Hmm. Okay. Domesticated animals usually all beg for <laughs> yeah. food. Yeah, that's just begging from nature, I guess. <laughs> I, I don't know. It's because like the uh, the bearded dragon doesn't beg for food. He just he sits there and it's just like that's because he expects it. What the fuck's a bearded dragon? That's lizard. what he calls Scott. Remember, <laughs> you remember lizard? Yeah. Lizards a bit. Well, actually, uh, lizard lizards. A you have a bearded dragon. dragon? My sister does. Oh. Well, they're, they're also kind of lower on the sentient scale, I feel. Yeah. Mm. They don't really have too many brain waves yeah. going on up there. Yeah. It's almost like a fish or a turtle. They're yeah, it's like, like, wow, rock, sunlight. Yeah. That's like, I know well, my turtle when I bring over, like, the, the not my little brother, an actual turtle. <laughs> um, I bring over the turtle food, I shake it, he, like, starts to, like, oh, shit. <laughs> yeah, and then the turtle shit. starts coming over. Oh, yeah, and he yeah, starts yeah, freaking the fuck out. Like, the turtle does the same thing, yeah. yeah. Like, he knows he's gonna get fed, but it's not like he begs. Mm -hmm. It's just once he knows it's coming, he's just like, oh, shit. Yeah, like, like oh, shit. Fish I beg also. Do that. Yeah. I don't think they beg, they just get excited. Like, um, begging, I don't know, I can't really see a turtle... Like we're acknowledging that this turtle is begging for food. I, I was like, gonna say, there, there's a lot of times where like dogs will be like, oh my god, stop begging. It's like, I don't really think he's begging. I think he just likes his head on my lap. Yeah. Like Sava with Lily. Uh, Lily, yeah. like even though we're eating and Lily's just sitting there staring, obviously, like she probably wants food, but she's yeah, like, like even begging. when we don't have food, that's what she does. Yeah, well, now she jumps on us, but yeah, no, dogs yeah. definitely beg. Uh, yeah. they, they beg, but, it, but it's hard Lily, to tell the yeah, difference. Like some dogs usually try to put their paw on your la like lap. It's like, hey, man, 
I want food. But, like, Lily kind of just stares at us. Well, that's that's like, still big. My dogs do that, too. Yeah. I'm fine with them staring. As long that's as they're not, like, really fucking knocking time. on my knee. Yeah, it depends just, like, how close they are. Food. If they're, like, right at my legs staring, that's kind of... Let's well, see, no matter what, whether I have food or not, Lily just jumps on me and, like, sits on my lap right in front of me, no matter what. <laughs> yep. It's like... I, I can't really call that begging because that's what she would have done anyway. Oh no, that's not begging. Begging is when they kind of give you those soulful eyes and they're like, I haven't eaten. Yeah, dogs can't <laughs> not give you soulful eyes well, though. I can tell the difference with Lily yeah, because if, if I don't have food, Lily will put her her face in front of my face so I can't watch TV and <laughs> yeah. press her head against my face. But if you have so food, I can't she, breathe or talk. If you have food, she's like <laughs> it sitting in front of you, just staring at you, which I don't mind because as long as she's not like on my lap staring yeah, at my if face. If that's the difference, I'd prefer she beg because then she's not just sitting on me. Yeah. Like. <laughs> yeah. Our, Taking uh, all of my oxygen from me. Our newest addition to the family, uh, Odin... Uh, he he begs all the time. It's a cat Wait, or a dog? Do, do, to be, you mean your family? Not, yes. Not the Dad Five crew. Oh, oh no no yeah, no. We, oh, we yeah. uh, a uh, my, Norse guy. <laughs> we've, we've not my, yeah. my family. No, we don't um, have a family. So wait, Odin is it a cat or? Yeah, dog? it's 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 a kitten. Um, it's a male kitten, and like, uh, I'll just be like sitting on the couch or whatever. He'll be like completely in, in the other room. I I won't even know he's coming. But just walk in, <laughs> sit down, stare at me, and go. <laughs> I'm like, no, I'm, so <laughs> I'm like, stop it! I don't want us to go away. <laughs> Three in the fucking morning, you're trying to sleep. You have work in the morning. Is he meowing or is no, that no, like? No, no, that's, that's what it sounds like. He doesn't meow. That. When he said, I don't even know he's coming, I <laughs> That's the cutest fucking cat noise ever. Like, like, what if you... <laughs> the cat starts, starts coming. <laughs> oh, no! This is how it makes when it's then, coming. Then you know he's coming. No! <laughs> <laughs> you do it any other oh. time. I mean, if I'm walking in the kitchen, that's the only other time. Maybe he yeah, just likes you. He's in a completely different room. He doesn't even see you. Or hates you. <laughs> he has some type of strong emotion towards you. I don't know which one it is. Your sorry. cat's fucking weird. Oh, uh, yeah. Right, it's about to get... <laughs> Maybe he is coming. Oh, no. <laughs> really oh, blood, you're my owner. <laughs> It's your sister's cat, though, isn't it? Yeah. Is he the one that Scott took in from a box? Yeah. I think you mean the bearded dragon. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Next. Next question. Uh, All right. Um. Is there a point to na na ing a song? Wait, what? Uh, <laughs> oh, like, I, I, I can song. understand this one. Like okay. I, I get this because there are a lot of songs that just have like na or la or o oh as lyrics. Yeah. And he's questioning whether or not there's a point to that. There is a point to that. It's, it's, not, what is it's that? not a good point, but there's a point. So what is so that? So people can sing along. It's so, you can catch, it's so you can fill time and actually complete the song and make the money. Uh, well, well, that's... So you can just leave it with no lyrics. Yeah. It's both... Well, there's a lot of reasons. It's catchy, too. It's catchy. And then, people can sing to it without knowing the words. Yeah. And also... Easy to write. It's it's easy, it's easy as shit to write. So, and so and sometimes right. they're just filling in melody. For example, the police. It definitely every little thing he does is magic at the very end. It's yeah. just like. Oh hi. Yo, yo. Like what the fuck? Yo. Sixteen times. Uh, Come on. <laughs> yeah. Sixteen yos. Yeah. yeah. Wait, no, but these are all thoughts you had on the fourteenth. No. It was just thoughts like I, I didn't uh like date them. Okay. Uh, because well, you've did, all, you've, did you have casual sex you've, with them? You've, you've, uh, all, you've, all, you've all had these. Yes. You've all had these under <laughs> least week, week, week of thoughts. Oct October fourteenth to the twenty first. Um. You haven't had any thoughts since then. Well, that is when I thought it was gonna be uh the, the time frame for this, <laughs> but uh. <laughs> This there's like no passive aggressive right, right at here. All. But um, do you have any? It, do you have any more thoughts on your phone? You might share for us. Wait, are, are we out of thoughts? I, I, I was we, say, we're, that we're, we're we have two more. I do have, I think, a few more on my phone. All right, all right. you right. finish those up while Bud brings up his phone yeah, thoughts. So, um, five jingles over intercoms are better. It's true. 
What? What? what, what explain. Are you, what are you talking about? All right. <clears throat> so at Giant, I hear <laughs> pre-recorded whatever over, over over the intercoms like so many times a day, and it's pre-recorded just like pre-recorded whatever. What is it? This oh like hey at Giant we have. Turkey salad. No, sales. no, no, not not even that. It's something like, <laughs> oh, go long, uh, yay, football season. Get your nachos or whatever. It's like <laughs> it sounds better when it's more. Well, well, when like a person picks up the phone and reads yeah. off the sale. I w- I would like that more because it's it's more genuine than like these fake people that they have for these like fake people. <laughs> they, they sound so fake. Bud hates posers. <laughs> but posers. Hold on, hold on. Posers. Yeah. Hey, can we get an example of one of, of these? a poser? Real please? quick, Bud. I need you to go to Giant, sneak into the intercom, and say, "Welcome to Giant. We have turkey salad sales." He gets fired for that. What if they're not selling turkey salad? Yeah. And they're not on sale. And they're not on Turkey salad? I've never heard of turkey salad. Here's here's an example. Turkey salad. We got an example here. Turkey salad has to. I mean, here's like, I guess you could make it, but I don't know. Conceptually, it exists. Yeah, yeah. All right, here we go. Here's an example. Here's an example of one that that I really hate. Pears, 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 pears. Good things come in USA pears. <laughs> and that's it, it just cuts off. Yep. <laughs> pears, 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 pears. Good things come in USA pears. So you would like it if it was just like, Good evening, giant shoppers. We got we have We got pears. We have a sale on karaoke chicken for lunch today. Um. <laughs> Soup, um, the chicken soup. <laughs> two cans, two cans for five dollars. Um, and um, uh, the ter- oh, I said teriyaki chicken already. Um, uh, that's it for the sales for Giant. Uh, back to your music, Michael Jackson Thriller. Was that was that an actual sale though? That you that you give an example of pears, pears, pears. Yeah, yes. Nothing's better like U.S. pears. That doesn't really tell you what the sale is. All right, I'm like, like buy one like, get one free pairs. They should have said buy one get one free somewhere in there. It's like pairs, it was like pairs, oh twenty five percent off all pairs or what? They didn't tell you what the. Well, I mean, sale as the was. best things come in pairs. I mean, it's it's encouraging you to buy two pairs. Yeah, a pair of pairs. I thought they were talking about the fruit. They are. Yeah, but it's they're a saying buy a pair. So what pairs. the fuck is the sale? Buy one get one free pairs. How do something? I know that? Because you're buying a pair of them. S- see what I mean? It would be so much that easier. Doesn't su- that doesn't suggest to me that it's a buy one, get one free sale. Well, then market. you are not the demographic for that advertisement, I guess. I hate You're that. not the pear eating demographic uh, they want. Thank God. I'm not a big story. <laughs> Welcome, giant shoppers. Buy one, get one free pears. Pears, 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 USA pears. Yeah, now yeah, back. That would be better. Now back to Billy Jean's Not My Lover. The, why, why does Giant play so much? I would love that. Yeah, that was that was uh, Michael Jackson's not my Billy Jean did not sing that song. No. Billy Jean. Was, What's the name of the song then? It's just Billy Jean. Billie Jean oh, okay. oh. Michael Jackson, Billy Jean, not my lover. What? <laughs> this person doesn't know the full yes. song. Okay, like right, it'll cool. tell what songs are playing. Billy yeah, Jean, play. not my lover. <laughs> I mean, if I had to yeah, guess, that's what I would call the song too. So I, I, I can't fault you. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. And especially if it's like a live one, it's just like that guy. Like he's gonna fuck up. He's not gonna. Yeah, like, he's not gonna get everything. Well, welcome to a jungle, Guns N' Roses. Now back to WMFP rocks. That was that was correct though. Yeah. Because I'm yeah, yeah good, but it was so pretty Michael good Jackson's thriller playing. <laughs> <I'm pretty, laughs> it doesn't mess up all the time. Yeah, all right, um, I'm pretty good. That was, that was Scott that did it before. That's Scott from Giant. Bearded I'm actually, Dragon. Scott yeah. Giant, International yeah. Super Spy and Lumber This is Big Scott Giant, which I, I'm actually really good at my job. So, um, Big Scott? I'm, Mike? I'm actually really good at my job. Bearded Dragon? Like, <laughs> buy one get one free pears um if you want to get watermelon we have watermelon buy some pears yeah, <laughs> now back to michael jackson um pyt i like that song yeah me too. <laughs> it's a good song all right and i think Giant we're on the last we're right, listening to this <laughs> we, have, um, we have we have the final question you have listed here how many places have you peed in your house? <laughs> <laughs> I forgot wait, to roll that. Wait, wait, is that for you to answer or for uh, us to answer? That's not even a thought. That's, that's <laughs> you just asking. Do you pee in your shower? Yes. Uh, actually, this is for Have you one. peed in your sink? No, all right, all right, but you answer first. Name all the places you've peed in your house. All right. We'll go clockwise. Well, I've peed in the toilet. Good. I've peed in the shower. Mm-hmm. 
I've peed in the bathroom sink. Okay. I've peed in the basement <laughs> sink. Okay. Uh, do, do we do we do backyards as yeah backyard? yeah that for it. Uh, backyard uh, front yard. Um, <laughs> All right, hold on. What time was it when you peed in your front yard? A time where no one was around. Okay. <laughs> good answer. Good answer. Um, it's family feud. <laughs> I've, I've peed in my room in a bottle. Yeah, um, okay. yeah. That's it. <laughs> you. Where have you peed? In? All right. Toilet and the laundry sink. That's it. Because I was really drunk and everyone's having a party upstairs, and I was just like. I really have to pee, and I really do not feel like walking past people because I had a boner because I was looking at porn for three hours. <laughs> have you have you never peed in the shower there? No, I don't like peeing in the shower. I love peeing uh, in the shower. It makes the shower dirty. So I aim for the drain. Yeah, yeah, but still, it gets all around stains. It. Well, I mean, I'm gonna use soap in the shower anyways, so it's. Just gonna... I don't know. My brother doesn't stain the whole oh, fucking tub. So maybe your brother is like an your alien. Your brother's a turtle. There's a difference. <laughs> no, my other brother. I'm guessing he pees in the shower. I don't know. My shower got fucking dirty when I lived uh, yeah, there. Okay, maybe I shouldn't pee in the shower. All um, right. Uh, well, as for example, if you pee in the toilet and don't flush it, yeah, there's water, but when you finally flush it two days later, it does stain the, the bowl. Yeah, that, that's true, but like, like, I'm, not, I'm, not, soap in it, I'm not leaving the urine to sit there. You know, I'm gonna I know, it, but, but you know, still, I get your point. Uh, uh, I just avoid it because I there's a toilet right there, and before I jump in the shower, I pee in the toilet. Well, well, I don't like going there like, yeah, I'm gonna pee in the shower. <laughs> <laughs> like, I'll, I'll just be in the shower and oh, I have to pee. Well, I'm not gonna hold it. Just yeah, crab see, walk I, into I, the bathroom and stuff. <laughs> 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 and like the the the, the laundry room sink thing was pretty much my I live in the basement anyway and yeah I, I drank a lot of beer that night and I was like holy shit and there was a football game going on and there were a lot of people out there and I had a yeah. massive boner and it was like this would be really awkward and I'm really drunk let's just go in the sink because when people do wash the soap thing just goes in the sink and fills it up pretty well and it's just like I'll wash it out and I, I used the water to kind of rinse it out just in case, yeah, and that should be it was just that one night uh, Which is also Smidge's house, so now he knows I peed in that sink, but I don't think... I, I don't I, fucking care. I think you expected me to pee in that sink. <laughs> well, like, the, 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 the little sink in my room, pretty much. Oh, in the basement? Yeah, yeah. dude, I peed in there. Yeah, so it's just like, I, I tried to avoid it, but it was just that one time. <laughs> it happens. I mean... Yeah, it was just that one time. And I really <laughs> I, 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 I've, got, I've, pretty much, I've got a laundry list, like, five okay. days, so I'm not one to blame. Okay, well... Okay, uh... I have two bathrooms in my apartment, uh, both toilets, both showers, a uh, <laughs> bottle in my room. I think that's it. Now, right. should we have another list for where we put our semen at? Uh, <laughs> no, Bud, do you, uh, do, that's up to Bud. Bud, do you want to have a list for that? Is there a my, list? Mine's a very short list then. Yeah. The fucking toilet. I We're know. done. <laughs> I don't know. Never, I, never like directly. Usually, it's usually like into a fucking paper towel or something. I mean, if you guys, yeah, yeah, paper towel, pa- paper towel, paper towels. Towels. Yeah. All right, it's empty. It's good. Yep, you're empty. Um, I will go last on that question if you guys want well, to. Do I that. answered mine. Uh, Tom, Tom, very simple. Tom, uh, mm-hmm. where have you peed in your house? And then where have you semen? D- well, <laughs> we don't. We don't we, no, not semen yet. We don't need to semen yet. I already answered my semen question. That's your fault. Toilet, shower, bottle of my room, and. <laughs> Oh, nice. Oh, you peed an end? Nice. Yeah. Nice, dude. We, um, we both pee similarly. That's yeah. pretty cool. I've peed, <laughs> yeah. I've peed in my backyard. I've peed in any toilet that's in my house. I've mm-hmm. peed in just about any sink that's in my house. Mm-hmm. I've peed in bottles. Um, I lived with my grandmother for a bit, and she had cats. I peed in their litter box. <laughs> <laughs> you peed in the cats. What? No, no. What? I, peed in their, I peed in their litter box. No. That kind of makes sense. Um, yeah, that's what it's there for. Yeah, I mean, I don't <laughs> fucking It's literally care. there for urine. Um, literally. Urine. <laughs> oh, yeah, my, my urine's better than cats. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> All right, real question. Why do people pee in sinks? If the toilet's right there, if it's the bathroom. Well, some no, I only pee in sinks when the toilet's taken up. Yeah, and I really yeah. gotta fucking go. I never yeah. pee in the bathroom. So me. there's been a time that someone was on the toilet while you're in the bathroom, and you just pee in the sink. Not when I'm in the bathroom. No, no, no like in the kitchen just, sink or something. Yeah, it's just like uh, it's just like the bathrooms are taken up. I really gotta pee. So what's I'm not gonna wait. In the, in the kitchen sink, then I'll pee in the kitchen sink. I'll pee in your sink. I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> I don't care. It's like it's a drain. Like you remember. When I lived That's in my, fine. I'm just you, afraid because you remember like the bathroom sink and gave like, my toothbrush. Do you remember when I lived? In, do you like, remember when I lived in the highway and I, I just had a drain on the fucking floor of my bedroom? Oh no! Oh. Don't fucking tell me you peed that. Oh, that's, yeah. that's cool. I would have loved to do that. I peed. I there. mean, not not in his drain, but I peed one of my there. Rooms. My mother's peed <laughs> there. It, we don't care. 
<laughs> it is a drain, it goes down, who cares? I'd be afraid to like splash. Well, if you're a retard, you splash. Well, I mean, it's hard to aim heavy artillery, man. <laughs> what the fuck? It- yeah, no, I know. <laughs> no, Nick Fasig's on heavy duty piss. Some, sometimes it comes I, I do. Strong. Dude, like, I, I drink a lot of liquor. I, I've got a lot of pressure in my I penis, but damn, like. If you splash, you just kind of wipe it up, move on. Alright, so we say where we, uh, semen? <laughs>